Welcome to ComSpark. Today we are in Dayton, Ohio. My name is Zach Heck and I am on the Executive Host Committee for ComSpark and I'm going to be your guest host today. Today we are joined by Kristen Clausing of American Heritage Girls. Kristen, thank you for being here. Thank you for having me. So, Kristen, tell me what industry changes have affected the American Heritage Girls over the last five years? I would have to say um, it's a very different world with working in a nonprofit organization. Uh, money is hard to come by, so IT is usually lower on the list. Uh, but this past year, I've been at American Heritage Girls. They've really taken the initiative to want to step forward in technology in support of the staff and the volunteers and the members that are part of the organization. Uh, so being more mobile friendly from a website standpoint uh, to membership management software, trying to be more advanced than that. Uh, and also privacy in general, making sure that everything's secure, that we're following GDPR standards uh, and all compliance in general. Since technology is rapidly evolving, what has been your approach to managing change in technology? Uh, communication <laughs> is number one to me, uh, having a dialogue of what's happening. Uh, making sure it's, it's important that staff understands what is going on in the IT world um, and being able to train others on what's happening. Um, advancing in different technologies, uh, even moving to the cloud is important and being able to teach others how to use it. Technology can be scary for people, and if you're able to train them and make it not so scary, then it doesn't make it as dangerous either. Um, so I think it's important to be able to step forward and, and train others. And it's also important to communicate and have a network of people that you work with. Uh, I have a network of other IT um, folks that I've built over the years being in the industry. And anytime I'm not sure of something or I just want a, another opinion, I always reach out to my network. And I think it's so crucial in any industry, really. What would you consider to be the most crucial duties of an IT director? Um, wow, I would have to say the most important thing is to, to gain the trust of the employees that you're working for and with. Um, you have to have a foundation of trust before you can move anything forward in technology of the leadership and of the staff. Um, but once you have that, you have to have contributions from others. Um, it's, it's important to know what's happening in the technology realm and know the actual industry that you're a part of to be able to best support and know different um, platforms that are out there, different ways that we can actually come across problems that we have and form technology around them that have already been built and technology that we can, uh, just different platforms that we can build ourselves to do that. Uh, so to me, it's just, it's, it's important to know your business, to speak to your other leaders and collaborate together as a team. So moving up the ranks to IT director, what's the most important thing you've learned? that I'm not doing this alone. <laughs> um, I would say team is number one. Um, uh, right now I work for uh, American Heritage Girls, which is a nonprofit ministry, and um, it's daily, it's just um, an exciting place to go uh, to know that the work that I'm doing actually flows down to volunteers and also ultimately impacts girls' lives that are a part of this ministry. Um, and, you know, uh, I would say that the, the Lord has given me a lot of strength and a lot of mercy in my walk to, to be where I am. And I'm not the most, uh, I, I don't find myself having all of the answers and all of the knowledge of everything IT, but um, I seek out people and I seek out others and advice and, and others that have gone before me and um, being able to train others that are coming behind me. And uh, to me, teamwork is number one. And if you don't have a team, then you're not going to be able to move forward. I agree 100%. Thank you, Kristen, for joining us. And for more information, you can visit comspark.tech.